What is up, everybody? Welcome to another brand new video. This is Searching for Hits with Eric, and I am Eric. And today we got a flea market video for you. Went over to MetLife Stadium. They have their big flea market every weekend. Haven't been there yet, but uh, went there, found a couple of different vendors selling some uh, some baseball cards and other sports stuff. Picked up a few things. Um, not a whole lot jumped out at me, but was able to get a little bit that we're going to open up today. Um, these are some grab bags for a dollar each. Not expecting a whole lot, but we'll open them up and see if there's anything good in there. Uh, did get a blaster of Stadium Club, which is pretty cool. 2021 20, Stadium Club. Got these two packs of 91 Bowman. We'll take a look at those. Um, they had one, they were, I found one pack of 2017 series, two tops, a hobby pack for like $2. So I picked that up and uh, found one pack of 93 four sport drafts. Um, I vaguely remember this set. This was sitting in a box of, of non-sports cards. So pick this up. Um, so we'll crack into this, see what we can find. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so. Love to have you along for more videos. Also, make sure that you like the video, turn your alerts on, and here we go. Shoot a comment my way, let me know what you think about my pickups. Um, looks like uh, everything all together, I spent about $40, give or take. So that's the value that we're looking for. So I do have some plastic uh, top loaders and some sleeves here for the hits. Let's get cracking. We'll start off with these grab bags, um, just because I'm not expecting a lot from them. Then we'll open up the classic pack here, followed by the Bowman and the 2017 pack, and we'll finish off with the Stadium Club Blaster. So away we go. Let's see what we can find. These were only a dollar each. I expect some junk wax cards in here, but uh, you never ever know. I figured for a dollar it's worth worth checking out so here's pack number one we got some 2020 heritage on top uh samarja kipnis um actually these are 2018 uh, pardon me um jason kipnis pat neshack a little ding there matt coke domingo santana um addison russell fultonevich greg holland mike matuk Quato. Ah, oh, we have some holiday. That's kind of cool. I don't have much holiday in my PC. We got Locaine. Uh, we got George Springer. And this is from 2019 Tops Holiday. CJ Cron. We got an Adam Jones. We got Scherzer, who just got traded to the Dodgers. Jose Altuve. Uh, Eduardo Escobar who just got traded as well. I don't remember where he ended up. Lucas Giolito, Josh Donaldson, and Hunter Renfro. All right, we're shifting gears to some Allen and Ginter from 2012. We've got Jim Tomei. There's a Jose Reyes in his weird Marlins uni. Always looks weird to me. Uh, Matt Holliday. Uh, we got... Ryan Roberts, Dallas Keuchel from 2018, Allen and Ginter, Luis Arcia, or Orlando Arcia, uh, Paul DeYoung from 2018, Mike Leak, Ryan Braun, and Kenley Jansen. Now we switch over to Bowman from 2012, uh, Nick Delmonico, Howie Kendrick, J.J. Hardy, Joyce, Aaron Sebia, Bud Norris. We got a rookie card of Brad Peacock, Salvi Perez. Um, that's actually Salvi Perez before he came up to the majors. Still has his minor league stats. That's kind of cool. Uh, Bud Norris again. He's got two Bud Norrises. Ben Zobrist. Uh, there's Evan Longoria. Pretty early in his career. Mark Reynolds, Jamil Weeks, Josh Beckett, Romero, Hosmer. That's Hosmer. It's his second year card. Brandon Morrow, Alex Gordon, uh, Colin Cowgill, rookie card. He had a cup of coffee with the Mets. And Dustin Ackley. So 
Nothing too spectacular, but for a dollar, we got a few rookies. We got some holiday cards. Not, not too bad. Um, yeah, not too bad at all. Let's see what's in this other dollar grab bag here before we move on to the unopened packs and blaster. Trying to get this open here without making too much of a mess. There we go. Don't know what that is. We got something shiny in there from Elite Edition. All right, let's see what we got here. Uh, Leonis Martin. When are these from? These are from 2015 Elite Extra Edition. Uh, Sunny Gray. Sunny Gray's second year card from Elite. That's not bad. Greg Holland. These are all from 2015. Hunter Pence. Wei Yin Chen. All right. Switching over some tops from series two of 18. Uh, Dyson, Locane, Tony Watson. All smiles. Uh, none of those guys are with the Cubs anymore after a crazy trade deadline. Uh, same thing for the Pirates team card. That's Harrison and Bell, no longer there. Diamondbacks, Tyler Flowers, Ricky Weeks, Blaine Boyer, Shaw, Cole Hamels, Connolly. Let's see here. Rookie combos of Greg Molly and Andrew Triggs. Nothing too crazy. You know, Escobar. Pirates Mateys, no longer with the Pirates. Bogarts, Campusano. Mm. Here's Min, uh, Magnarius Sierra from 2018. Pops Heritage, Eric Sogard. Brandon Belt, Lance McCullers. Carlos G Gomez, that's, is that a reverse negative card? Carlos Gomez is a righty. I don't know why he's batting lefty there. That might be something weird going on. I'll have to check into that. If you happen to know, let me know. Hunter Renfro, some more uh, Holiday. Miguel Sano, CJ Cron, Luke Weaver, and Max Kepler. Some Alan Ginter, Trevor Bauer, Leek, Mel uh, Miggy, Josh Reddick. And some Bowman, Billy Butler, another Bud Norris, Jared Parker, Gold Ricky Card, Alex Gordon. There's Mike Moustakis, Euclid, Romero, Tommy Malone, played for the Mets for a season or two. And Tori Hunter finishes off that mystery pack. So nothing spectacular, but some decent little cards here and there. Um, I am curious about this Carlos Gomez. Again, something just doesn't look right about that. He bats righty, he throws righty, and yet he's batting lefty in the card. So that's interesting. All right, so those were our mystery packs. Again, nothing too crazy, but let's get into these other packs. Classic four card draft. Um, there are autographs to find in here. They are few and far between. I don't know if you can read those odds, but feel free to pause it and check it out. I'm not expecting much, but for the dollar that I paid for it, I felt like it was certainly worth taking a look. Uh, we have Ben Coleman. These are 93 for sport. Uh, that is John Wooden, Coach Wooden. Uh, there's uh, Chris Weber, I believe. Yeah, Chris Weber. It's not bad. Uh, we have Willie Harris. As you can see, we got a mix of baseball, football, basketball. There's Pat Watkins. Pat Watkins. Don't remember him. Devin McDonald. There's our first hockey card. It's 
know who that is. Madsen? Jesper Madsen? Uh, we got Greg Graham. Terry Kirby. Natron Means. Dennis Peterson. And the final card is going to be a George Lynch. So a couple of nice basketball players. Chris Webber probably being the best out of the bunch. All right, let's check out these 91 Bowman and see what we can find. I don't remember who the big cards are in 91 Bowman. Uh, I wanted to say Chipper is in this set with his rookie, but that might be 92. So we're going to kind of go flying through this blind. Let's see if we can find some Hall of Famers. It's Burks, Oscar Zokar, Sid Bream. I remember these from when I was collecting. There's Mike Mussina. That's a Mike Mussina rookie card. So that's a good hit right there. We'll take that, Mike Mussina. Great pitcher right there. Carlos Quintana. Dennis Oil Can Boyd towards the end of his career. Bob Melvin. Went on to coach, Wes Gardner, Turner Ward, Kelly Downs, Tony Pena. There's a Wally Joyner, Daryl Strawberry. It's got the little slugger icon right there. Like that a lot. Don Robinson, also with that slugger icon. Like Humphreys, Johnny Ard. I do not remember him. John Farrell. William Pennyfeather, that's an interesting name. Ramon Martinez, Pat Combs, uh, Glenn Sutko, Schooler. There's Joe Carter, World Series hero for the Blue Jays. Ben Rivera and Rene Gonzalez. So a couple of good cards out of there. Mike Bacino, rookie being the highlight. And let's see what we got in our second Bowman pack. Hope everyone's having a great Saturday, enjoying the weekend. I know we got some fantastic weather up here in the Northeast. It's Jesse Barfield, Pete Harnish, Bernie Williams. That's Bernie's Bowman rookie card. So that's really nice as well. We'll take that. Bernie Williams. Let's just move this up a little bit so that we get those cards on screen. Our hits, Scott Lewis, Kevin McReynolds, Brudansky, there's a MVP, Matt Niski, MVP of Tim Howard. I don't remember either of them, it must be minor league MVP. Yeah, Niski was the 1990 player of the year in the Northwest League. Tim Howard was the player of the year in the South Atlantic League. Neither made a big impact in the majors, at least not to my recollection. Willie Ansley, Pat Lennon, there's Brady Anderson, Greg Olson, Cal Ripken Jr. Nice card right there. Hall of Famer Cal Ripken, Dave Magadan, Tim Belcher, Haney, there's Eric Karros coming off uh, his rookie of the year. So that's his Bowman rookie card, and he went on to win the rookie of the year that year. Kirby Puckett as well, another Hall of Famer. So getting some nice cards in that pack. Very cool stuff. Okay, now let's move on to our 2017 Series 2 Hobby Pack. Don't know why this was just sitting there by itself, but... Here's the odds from 2017 Series 2. Let's see what we can find. 2017 Update is the big one. I don't remember which rookies are in 2, uh, but Update's the one you really want to go for. David Price, Brett Gardner, Jose Abreu, there's an MVP for you. Pittsburgh Pirates, another team card. First pitch, Danny Willett at Yankee Stadium. There's a TJ Rivera rookie. He was looking promising for a little while with the Mets. McCutcheon, 
Martin Perez, and Tony Walters. Closes out that pack. So nothing crazy going on in there. All right, let's move on to our blaster of Stadium Club. Love Stadium Club's photography. A little bit tough to find a hit in Stadium Club, but it would be awesome to find one. So I'll show you the odds on the box right there if you want to freeze it and take a look. Odds are not great, but they are there. And that's why we go searching for hits, to find those great hits. All right, and there is our, our top loader, our master photo of Bobby Dahlback. So that's pretty cool. We got a rookie master photo, Bobby Dahlback. And within the box, five cards per pack. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Eight packs total. Let's get ripping. Okay, pack number one. Hammer and Hank Aaron right on top. I love that card. Hank Aaron, along with an Ichiro, so another Hall of Famer right there. Really like the Stadium Club design. Their photography is always amazing. Uh, Tariq Skubal, rookie card, very nice. There's a superstar duo of Ronald Acuna and Freddie Freeman. Superstar duo, duo. obviously Acuna is, uh, is out for the rest of this year with his knee injury, hoping he'll be back at some point next year. And uh, Loris Gurriel finishes out that pack. Okay, pack number one in the books. Pack number two coming up. Just a reminder, go ahead and hit that like button and let me know what you think about this haul that I got from, from our flea market locally here. There's an Edward Oliveras rookie card. Got a Joey Gallo. Anthony Rendon, we got an upside down card of Mike Broussard, and that's because it is a red foil parallel. And Luis Patino, rookie card. So getting some rookies, there's our first parallel. They give you at least a couple of those parallels, reds and blacks in each blaster box. Really hoping to find an auto. Haven't found an auto yet in Stadium Club, and I opened up a few blasters, so. Feel like it's about time for me to get lucky. Let's see if we can do so. Here's Ricky Henderson, stealing third, it looks like. DJ LeMayhew. Here's a Keston Hira. We got a George Brett. Throwback Stadium Club design. It's pretty cool. And a Trevor Bauer. Nothing too wild in that pack. Next pack up. Got Jazz Chisholm on the back. That's nice. One of the top rookies. And Jake Cronenworth. Arguably the best rookie in the set. I'm going to go ahead and get that sleeved up real quick. Jake Cronenworth making a big push for Rookie of the Year in the National League. Having a fantastic year. Cronenworth, that's what the back of the card looks like. Nice card right there. Jake Cronenworth. Brandon Crawford. We got a Jock Peterson, who's no longer with the Cubbies. He's now over in Atlanta. And we have Jose Abreu, virtual reality card. And there's Jazz Chisholm on the back, who I'm going to go ahead and get sleeved up as well. Jazz Chisholm, certainly top Five rookies in the set, I believe. Okay, and there's that virtual reality card. Which is not even on screen. Okay. Four packs remaining. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. the video. There's Kiebert Ruiz on the back. And Joe... Uh, 
Jonah Heim on the front, rookie card. Albert Pujols, still in his Angels uni. Miguel Rojas, there's a Byron Buxton upside down because it is a red foil parallel to go along with the other one. And there's Kiebert Ruiz, who was traded in that big trade or that big deal uh, to bring Turner and Scherzer across to L.A. So, Kiebert Ruiz, nice catching prospect. Three packs remaining, still hoping for a hit. Uh, Clint Frazier. Joey Votto, uh, Johan Mancata, We've got an Ernie Banks upside down because it is also a red foil parallel, and Byron Buxton once again. All right, two packs left. Hoping for some last pack magic here. There's Pujols again, Snell. We got an Ian Anderson rookie. That's a nice one. And Ramon Laureano. That's going to be a black foil parallel right there with Aaron Nala on the back. And now our last pack of the video. Thanks once again for watching. Make sure you do subscribe and leave a like on the video. see what we got in our final pack. There's a Robin Yount jumping up, trying to turn a double play, it looks like. John Means, Marcus Stroman, uh, Anderson Tejeda. That's going to be a red foil parallel rookie card. And Aaron Judge, last card in the pack. So no hit, but some nice rookies. Couple of nice parallels, like Stadium Club, quite a bit. But, uh, yep, that's going to do it for my flea market finds. Hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And let me know if I, uh, if I did well at the flea market today. Hope everyone has a great weekend. And we will see you next time on Searching for Hits with Eric.